Franklin and Medway are great communities, and the people of these towns know how to get things done. That's what makes me proud to live here and be your state representative. It's why I've advocated for legislation that will protect our planet and citizens and give us the energy independence needed in the face of global warming and climate change. It's why I advocated for financial protections for students in higher education. It's why I've advocated for healthcare legislation that would increase access for the most vulnerable members of our Commonwealth. It's why I have led on efforts to enhance educational opportunities for students, including the Genocide Education Act signed by the governor in 2021. And it's why I've reached across the aisle and worked on bipartisan legislation to protect people from cyberbullying, revenge porn, home equity theft, insurance company interference with medical decision making, and campus sexual assault. But being a state representative takes more than just passing laws. It's about looking out for your neighbors and letting them know you have their back. Everything's personal for Jeff and everything leads back to how can I better represent the people. Jeff Roy has stood up for those in the margins, in the shadows, for those who never had a voice. It's why I worked for improvements to the commuter rail service and infrastructure delivered funding for the SNET Trail and the tunnel under Prospect Street, parking at Franklin State Forest, the Medway Community Farm, and improvements to recreational spaces in both Franklin and Medway. It's why I advocated for a cultural district in our area and stepped up for entrepreneurs and nonprofits like the Franklin Food Pantry, the Franklin Performing Arts Company, and the Medway Community Farm. He shows up. He shows up for his community, and I've seen that for almost 10 years. Nobody works harder for the town of Franklin than Jeff Roy does. To confront the challenges we face, our community needs continued leadership and collaboration. We need someone with the experience and the know-how of governing. And we need a strong commitment, relentless perseverance, and sincere empathy. Franklin and Medway deserve nothing less. And it's why I'm asking for your vote this November.